practice. Hey guys, it's Desert Alchemist, and uh, today I want to teach you about a new mushroom. This is called Amanita rubescent, and I want to compare the Amanita rubescent to the Amanita muscaria. So here you have both, side by side. Both Amanitas um, have, you know, the white mycelium on the cap, kind of looks like warts. Um, the rubescent loses, loses its veil um, very easily, but they both have the bulbous base, like I explained in other videos. Now, the difference between these two mushrooms is that uh, this one is very, very brittle and it will break super easily. The stem is always like, feels like it's hollow. And um, this is actually an edible, but this is not for beginners. Um, I wouldn't recommend a beginner trying this because uh, some of my friends have had like stomach problems, from, uh, stomach problems from eating this. So I would recommend um, a lot of caution when you eat this. It could upset your stomach, could not. Definitely you don't want to eat this one. <clears throat> but the difference between both of them uh, is obviously the color on the cap. Uh, this one has a skirt always attached unless somebody rips it off. But they both have white gills. Actually, this one hasn't even opened. This one still has a veil attached. So maybe that's why there's no veil. But we have an older one over here. And I'm going to try and pull this out. These guys break easily. So, yeah. So they both have veils, but this broke so fast. As I told you, they break super easily, yes. But they both have um, veils, <clears throat> except for the Amanita rubescent is a Amanita that's always pink colored. It always has like a pink color. And when you slice it, it stains a little bit red. And they are edible. They are citrusy flavored. But uh, like I said, you have to be cautious when trying to eat something like this. Um, so just be careful when you're out there um, looking for this. But if you find an Amanita that has a pink color and it's mostly white and pink, most likely it's an Amanita rubescent, uh, which you can eat as long as you cook it properly. But I uh, just wanted to share that video for you guys so you can identify this kind of mushroom in case you want to try something exotic. But um, also be careful.